So these are with tungsten switches, which a few vendors will have. Um, My KBEU, Daily Clack, Espresso, as well as I think one or two other vendors. Um, they're done with GS2 lube, and that's it. No filming. We're using GMK Firefly, aluminum plate, solder build PCB, and this is the Cerakoted Key Cult. We're using Stabies done with 2050 and dielectric grease. All right, let's quickly just open a notepad. Ooh. Look at this chat. So if you guys don't know what Cerakote FX is, essentially it's a Cerakote, a bit more sparkly. And depending on how we tilt the keyboard, the color changes as well. So depending on how light touches this keyboard, basically, it all changes. I can confirm with my eyes that this does happen depending on where I shift my body. So it's quite interesting definitely quite interesting i quite like this what is going on with my that was weird huh it's like getting glitched out over here in the center but yeah very very cool but yeah very very fun very very fun looking keyboard look at that guys look at this isn't this pretty isn't this gorgeous Oh yes, Mr. Space Cables is in chat. Hello, hello, Space Cables. You should pick up and move around the base. I mean, look at look at this one here too. Let's put it over here. This is a great example of how like the colors are kind of depending on where we put it. So this is gonna be very, very nice. Alex, do you think Stabies can trade blows with Zeal? Um, again, to kind of be honest with the whole stabilizer conversation, I don't think there's any one stabilizer. Like, let's be 100% real here, dude. I really don't think there's one stabilizer that literally, like, demolishes the other stabilizers. I think... A lot of the stabilizers, if you tune them right, can sound the same. I just think that when we're looking at stabilizers, dude, I think you're getting just a little easier to do. Are lavenders worth getting over JW or JWIC switches? I think they're very different switches. I think lavenders have a deeper sound profile, but my experience with lavenders from the three or four batches I've used and mod it is you have to be a little bit more careful with, um, with lavenders when you're modding them. The reason I say that is because if you end up like over lubing a lavender, dude, they feel like they feel weird. They feel sticky.
Here's the case. Cerakote FX by Mr. Reagan. So depending on how the light hits this, you can see it from a this angle. It almost looks like a purple. But look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Very, very, very nice. Very excited. Can you make me purple? Maybe. Very, very nice. Reagan killed with this. Is it because you've maybe heard that sound profile can be different with soldering or feel? I guess the first question is like, why do you want to solder? Um, I actually have no quarrels at all with hot swap boards. In fact, I encourage if you don't know like what switches you want to use a hot swap board. But um, in terms of like benefits of soldering, I'd say like the one reason if you want BAM to solder is layouts can be much different uh i personally haven't noticed a crazy amount of difference in sound or feel for the most part but so, it, some sometimes it is there depends on everything but i would definitely say that if it's just kind of like uh you're trying new things i would still pick with hot swap but i only t i tolerate it because i have a desoldering gun so it's really easy for me to kind of like quickly desolder something, swap things out on the fly, you know? You know, guys, I just also, without getting too sappy, uh, I wanted to thank you guys for being very open-minded with things here in our community. And, you know, I think in general, like the streamer, Twitch community for keyboards and discords. Um, reading through a lot of like Reddit comments and other comments online about the keyboard hobby and some people who are kind of like in it, it just feels like very extremely consumeristic where people just really want things and they don't care about anything else um it doesn't feel as passionate it just feels like they just people like want to own things for the sake of owning them so thank you guys i really do appreciate for sharing passion here like i seriously mean it that's what makes for me the keyboard hobby really fun
All right. Now we can put this all together, guys. This is going to be a lot of fun. We do have to do something which I've never done with a key cult, which is put on our gaskets. Because when Reagan Seracoats this, obviously you have to take off the gaskets. So, I need to figure out where all these gaskets go, because I have no idea. Absolute winner, hydrate. I got you, my guy. Well, actually, let's take a look at the board before we plug it all in. <sighs> I will find Future Funk for you guys, and we'll do a whole stream dedicated to Future Funk. Oh, that looks sharp, dude. We don't hear the pen pop anymore? I don't think... Has anyone subbed and not heard the pen pop? I'm pretty positive it pen popped. Oh, that looks good with Salvin's 
metal keycap art is in there. Future Funk 12 hour stream or Riot? Really? I'm pretty positive it still works. Yeah, so there we go. Boss, thank you so much for gifting a tier one sub. I appreciate you, dude. All right, chat. Sorry for the wait. I sincerely apologize. Are you guys ready to hear what the keyboard sounds like now? Yes or no, guys. No, you didn't drink yet? I did drink, Chozo. Ow. Hold on, chat. It's an aluminum plate. Tungsten switch is quite nice. Very nice. Yeah, dude, this is nice. You know what? Maybe Firefly is a nice set to have on it. Maybe Firefly is not a bad set. Still looks really good, though. I'm still going to look for future funk. I'm sorry, guys. Damn, dude. This sounds really nice. It does sound like a spray paint can, yeah. So what do we think, chat? Do we like it? How stiff is it? Uh, I wouldn't say it's stiff at all. It has a bit of a uh, little bit of flex. It's not, it's not stiff, but it's not exactly like bouncy or flexy at all. These are using stabies. But that looks pretty good. Very cool, though. Let's take another look at this. What a beautiful color, huh? What an absolutely beautiful color. Damn, dude, that looks hot. It does. It looks really good. I'm really happy with this. I don't know. I think this is really nice. I honestly do. I do think this is quite nice, chat. 